Now we have a new development in the young soldier found dead in her barracks at Fort Bliss on New Year's Eve. A fellow soldier is expected to be formally charged and face court martial. Stephanie Ramos joins us with more. Good morning, Stephanie. Robin, good morning. Asia Graham's family, as you can imagine, is devastated. They say soon after she arrived at Fort Bliss, just a few months after joining the Army, she was assaulted by a fellow soldier who is now facing a military trial. This morning, unanswered questions surrounding the death of 19-year-old Army soldier Asia Graham, found dead inside her barracks at Fort Bliss in Texas on New Year's Eve. My dad was in the Army. He was a first sergeant, and... He would let like, you yeah, have fun. I thought it was something for me. Graham had previously posted videos on YouTube talking about how excited she was to join the military. But according to Fort Bliss officials, last June, Graham reported to her chain of command that another soldier sexually assaulted her back in December of 2019. The investigation into her assault took several months. Charges not formally brought against the unnamed soldier until October. Two months later, she was dead. Army investigators saying foul play is not suspected in her death. Now this morning, that unnamed soldier is facing a full court martial after being charged with assault. Can you explain why it's taken so long to bring forward these military charges against her alleged offender? The military has had a real problem with this. The investigations take too long. Uh, the victims aren't kept up to date on the status. The case comes after the death of Vanessa Guillen last year. A 20 year old army specialist murdered after telling her family she was being sexually harassed. The outcry prompting changes in the military's response to such allegations. Graham's mother tells us the charges against uh, her daughter's alleged assaulter are too late. She doesn't believe her daughter was murdered, but says had her claims been handled better from the start, she could have received the proper mental health counseling before losing her life. Mm. Robin. All right. Stephanie, thank you. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.